Hi, it's Paul from TraderFifth.com, and this is an update on all my five hot stocks that I'm trading for 2019 as of the close of the 5th of April 2019. So let's start with the current open trades that we've got in at the moment. Remember, PTC is a very longer term swing on the weekly time frame. We are in a profit making position now. We're just trying to push through the center line of this strong weekly channel at the moment. If we can get some clear air through there, we should be good to go. But we are in profit right now. Uh, we're in about what was that 15% profit times risk. Well, remember, longer term, this is 20, 25 weeks uh, into the, you know, we've got to go into this trade to, to try and attempt to get to this longer term fifth wave target around about $117 there. So next is Adobe. So with Adobe, we've had a pretty rough ride really. We've got this, we've got the breakout here. We entered a fifth wave move, but it wasn't our target. Our target's $277 up here at this big resistance zone here. So uh, be very patient with this. Now we did pull back, rejected these lows here on thursday last week and then on friday the fifth we just consolidated we had a down day but lower volume so remember this is a breakout trade we can't really afford deep pullbacks on this so what i'm going to do is make this risk free so currently we're sitting at about 55 percent 60 percent profit times risk so taking the profit right now is not a bad thing but what i want to do is i want to make this risk free by adjusting the the trailing stop just above entry there so around about, uh, in fact, let's just, let's lock 10% in, okay? Let's get around about this low. Because if we if we breach this pivot low here where the wave one is here, we've got a really good chance of actually coming down quite fast. So what I've done is if I put the, two, the stop at 263.47, just below that pivot low there, locks in 10% profit times risk, not a lot, but it makes it risk free. That's the important thing. We're holding on to a lot of profit with these five stocks so far this year. Uh, that's not risk any um, that we don't need to. So this is risk free. We've got a little bit of profit. So UNP is next. Now, this is reasonably new. This is the second time we've been in UNP. We've had a really big win. Uh, but now we are looking, we're about, uh, you know, 40% profit times risk at the moment. We've had the big move up here. Remember, we're trading this time off the daily time frame. We've had the fifth wave trigger at 166.20. Then we've had the gap up and then we've had this creep down, this profit taking. At this moment in time, I'm not prepared to adjust the stop. I just want to look at this on the 60 minute time frame to show you uh, intraday, we are on a wave four pullback, which seems to meet all the criteria. And we've just had a bullish signal on our stochastic as well. So intraday, we've had this pullback to find support at our EMA cloud and our probability zones here. So intraday, we're looking good for maybe a black box breakout signal and a fifth wave intraday move at 170.12. So if you're not in UMP already, this would be a really good entry here. 170.12, the stop loss just probably just below the wave four, but we're already in this trade. All we're doing is looking for confirmation of how we did perform last week intraday. And we can see we've had some profit taking uh, a mild pullback, but it has met the criteria for our fifth wave pullback. And look where our um, fifth wave target zone is intraday, right at our big resistance level where, you know, where we want to push through. So UMP still doing pretty good. Remember Costco, we took profit on this one. There's no pullback yet. So we took a big 300% profit times risk and it's just made a new all time high. We are waiting now for this wave four pullback to happen. You know, we just got to be patient with this. So with these here, we just got to be patient. We've got to wait for it to pull back, wait for it to pull back in our pullback zones, make sure everything sets up right and then we get another go at it. We've made good profit on, on Costco so far. We're just looking for another two, maybe three trades this year. Looking really good so far. Into, again, we are not in this at the moment. We took massive profits and into on this. We're just waiting for a pullback now uh, for us uh, for another opportunity on, on maybe on this time frame or another time frame. At this moment in time, let's have a look 
what that looks like on intraday. Uh, it doesn't look too bad. We've had a nice pullback there. We've had a fifth wave move. Uh, and then we've come deep on a wave one, wave two. We could find that coming back some more, which we need really on the daily time frame. So again, this is this is coming off all time highs. We just got to be a little patient. This is why it's, this is this is just an experiment to show you that just with five stocks trading them for a whole year, what sort of profit you could yield from just concentrating on those five stocks. So we're doing okay. We've got a decent move on PTC. Adobe were risk free. UMP is a reasonably uh, new trade. So we're still being active, but being sensible on these five hot stocks. So hopefully this uh, makes sense to you and we'll keep updating you on these five hot stocks as and when we put new trades on or we're taking profits. So have a great trading day. Speak to you all soon.